Hello everybody, it's Emery48 here and welcome back to another Star Wars video. Today uh, we pick up in the canon timeline with some Clone Wars episodes. We start on Season 2, Episode 20, Death Trap. Boba sneaks onto a Jedi cruiser with clone cadets. Boba attempted to kill Mace Windu, but killed a trooper instead. Boba then sabotaged the reactor, causing the crew to abandon ship. Boba was picked up by bounty hunters in his dad's ship, and Mace and Anakin found the other cadets. Or Singh is one of the bounty hunters that is working with Boba. Episode 21, R2 Come Home. Mace and Anakin went to the wreck site. Aura and Boba had already set a trap and taken some survivors. R2 was able to get to the Jedi Temple and bring rescuers to Anakin and Mace who got trapped by the trap. Episode 22, Lethal Trackdown. Ahsoka and Plo Koon track Aura and Boba to Florum, where they met with Hondo. They captured Bosk and Boba. Aura crash landed in Slave 1 after being chased by Ahsoka. No, no body confirmation uh, on Aura, so don't think she's actually dead. Season 3, Episode 5. Corruption. Padme visited Mandalore and helped Satine root out corruption that led to kids getting poisoned. Episode 6, The Academy. Ahsoka went to Mandalore to help Satine root out corruption, finding the Prime Minister was a traitor, arresting him and his conspirators in the police department. Episode 7, Assassin. Ahso Zero hired Aura to assassinate Padme. Ahsoka helped prevent the assassination and arrest Aura Singh. Episode 2, Arc Troopers. Grievous and Asajj Ventress led an attack on Kamino. Anakin and Obi-Wan led a successful defense. Echo and Fives get promoted to Arc Troopers. Episode 4, Sphere of Influence. Ahsoka helped the Pantorans rescue the chairman's two daughters who had been kidnapped by the Trade Federation. Episode 8, Evil Plans. Cad Bane captured R2-D2 and C-3PO to get the floor plans of the Senate building for Jabba the Hutt. The Hutt Council also wants Cad Bane to break Zero out of Republic prison as Zero could reveal a lot of damaging information against the Hutt Council. Season 1, Episode 22, Hostage Crisis. I don't know why this one's here, because... Well, it should be here, but it had been listed previously, so I'd already watched it, so I didn't watch it again, but Cad Bane captures senators, including Padme and Bail Organa. Anakin saved the senators, but Cad Bane was able to get Zero out of prison. It does feel a little out of place since Or Singh was with him, so that's the real giveaway that this the, the, the whole thing just feels a little wonky. Uh... So it was supposed to be earlier, but probably, as well as the previous episode, the whole Zero thing is kind of wonky, because it felt like it had no context when I watched it before. Um, there's also a written adaptation episode, uh, written, written adaptation of this episode in short story form. Season 3, Episode 9, Hunt for Zero. Zero's ex breaks him out of hot prison. Cad Bane attempts to recapture him. Quinlan Voss and Obi-Wan are also tracking Zero. Zero's ex killed Zero and brought his incriminating info of the Hutt Council to Jabba. <clears throat> forces of Destiny. We move on from the Clone Wars for a little bit. We go back and forth here with Forces of Destiny. Season 1, Episode 10. Uh, it's in, like, weird order. Because it's, like, Jin, uh, Padme, and it keeps going back and forth. There's some... Uh, original trilogy stuff so it's, it's not a one through season kind of thing episode 10 teach you i will anakin and yoda train ahsoka into lightsaber combat uh, now these are very short they're four minutes with the credits and the intro so they're quick episode six the imposter inside ahsoka saved padme from an assassination attempt Episode 11, The Starfighter Stunt. 
Ahsoka teaches Padme starfighter combat, and Padme takes out a droid starfighter that ambushed them. Episode 4, The Padawan Path. Ahsoka saves a family from a malfunctioning droid on Coruscant and gets an extension to her Padawan braid. We go back to Clone Wars, Season 3, Episode 10, Heroes on Both Sides. Separatists launch an attack on Coruscant's power generator, eliminating talks of peace negotiations. The Senate votes to deregulate the banks to help afford more clones to supply the war effort. Episode 11, Pursuit of Peace. Dooku puts out a hit on Padme as she is leading the talks for peace within the Senate. Padme and Organa survive assassination attempts. Padme speaks to the Senate and convinces them to not pass the bill buying more clones as people across the Republic are suffering because funds keep getting diverted to the war effort. Pursuit of Peace short story is a written adaptation of episodes 10 and 11. Season 2, episode 15, Senate Murders. I really enjoy these episodes because they're, uh, they're given a look inside the politics in the Senate, and that's something that I always enjoy uh, in these universes, is the politics of things, as I was a, essentially a poli-sci major. Um, so seeing the inner workings that you don't really get too much detail on in the movies, uh, having full episodes pretty much dedicated to the Senate is pretty cool. Multiple senators on both sides of the uh, argument are murdered. Bale and Padme were attacked while investigating. The culprit has been arrested. Following the deaths, the Senate passed a bill to buy more clones. Forces of Destiny, we return to that. Season 2 now, Episode 2, Unexpected Company. Ahsoka third wheels with Anakin and Padme during mission of sorts. Uh, so they could get some alone time. Now that wraps up our journey in 21 BBY in the canon timeline. So we are now going to head over in the next video to the Legends timeline on 21 BBY until we move any farther in the Clone Wars. Let me know what you thought of Seasons 2 and 3 of the Clone Wars and Forces of Destiny down below in the comments. Thank you everybody so much for watching, and I hope you have a wonderful rest of your day.